How to effectively make better decisions in life. Ben danced to his own beat. He never listened to anyone, not his parents, or his instructors. Ben's motto was, I do it my own way. As a consequence, Ben's life was a series of bad decisions. He was unsuccessful in life. Nevertheless, Ben's decision-making never got any better. As the county guard shut the door to Ben's cell, he ordered, lights out, Ben screamed, I'm the man. You can't make me do anything. The prison light goes out. Ben is left in the dark. The Critical Decision Have you ever wondered why some people continue to make bad decisions? You see million-dollar celebrities doing it. You can see this action in government officials and business leaders. There are no discriminators. From the very rich to the poorest of the poor, we see people caught in a vicious cycle of bad decision-making. Sadly, we see it much closer than that. We witness relatives making those bad decisions. Despite all the wise counsel, the poor decisions continue. Why is it important to teach people how to make better decisions? Anthony Robbins, author of Awakening the Giant Within, attributes good decision making as a key attribute to a happy life. Best selling author Brian Tracy argues the further you think into the future, the better decisions you will make in the present to assure that future becomes a reality. Making better decisions improves the quality of one's life. Problem Identification I constantly hear young people proclaim, I'm grown. This statement implies I don't have to listen to anyone. I know best. Therefore, I can make my own decisions. Through series after series of bad decisions, the youth continues on merry ride of worsening consequences. Two things generally can stop this dead-end trap. One lies in becoming more mature with age, and the other is experience. In going through a series of bad decisions, a wise person gains insight on the consequences of a bad decision. Every person, regardless of their background or social standing, can benefit from good decision-making techniques. Here are some key steps to use. 1. Define the problem or issues. 2. Conduct research on the matter. 3. Discuss with respected individuals with similar circumstances. 4. Consider at least two alternatives. 5. Select best decisions based on your value system. 6. Move on and accept any consequences. The Right Path Making the right decision is a difficult process. No one will usually applaud your many good decisions, however, you will probably catch heat over the bad ones. Les Brown, author of How to Become the Person You Always Wanted to Be No Matter What the Obstacle, explains, your values are not set by government or church leaders. Your values give you consistency in the way you approach Lithia by holding to your beliefs, you can always stay on track toward your dreams. Well, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you liked it or found it useful, I invite you to give it a thumbs up. Now, if you are ready to overcome procrastination and the feeling of being stuck as you learn to make quick and good decisions and you are ready to take charge of your life, take action now and enroll in my course, Fast and Good Decision Making to Unlock Your Life Right Now. Click the link in the video description below and visit us at www.personaldevelopment.training. See you in the next video.